Is Cookie Monster gonna listen to the story with us? <laughs> Does Cookie Mon- Monster want to say good morning to everybody? And hello? Arr. Hello, everybody. Arr. That's not how you say hello. That's not how Cookie Monster would say hello. How would Cookie Monster say hello? He would say because he didn't want to talk. Oh, well, if he doesn't want to talk, then let's just hold him like this so that we can talk, okay? Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Storytime with Pastor Coley Lincoln and Cookie Monster. Our story today is Palm Sunday. Are you ready? Uh Friends, Jesus said to his disciples, I need to go to Jerusalem. I've got some important things to do, and I want to celebrate Passover with you there. Will you come with me? Sure, said the disciples. Passover is a great holiday, so much food, and what a wonderful story Passover celebrates. The exodus of God's people, the Israelites from Egypt. It's good to be with friends and family at Passover. So Jesus and his friends started to go to Jerusalem. When they got close to the city, Jesus said, I'd like two of you to go borrow a donkey in the next village over. Please tell the owner I need it. He'll understand. When the two friends came back with a donkey, Jesus climbed on its back and rode down the hill into the city of Jerusalem. The disciples followed behind him. It's time to turn the page. Can you help me turn the page? Thank you. Suddenly, they found themselves in a parade. People were singing and shouting, Hosanna, Hosanna, here comes God's king. Hosanna, praise God. People all over heard the shouting and singing and they joined the parade too. Hundreds of people, thousands of people. They started taking off their coats and laying them on the ground for Jesus and the donkey to walk on. They pulled palm branches down from the trees and waved them as they sang. Then they threw their... Hosanna, Hosanna. Hosanna! 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 Then they threw their palms on the ground to make a path for Jesus. The crowds gave Jesus a royal welcome as he rode into the city, just like a king. But Jesus was a very different king. He was a king of peace. Not everyone understood that. Jesus was not at all what they were expecting. They thought the crowd was too loud and the parade was getting too big. Let's listen to what happens next, okay? Are you listening? Listen, listen. They thought the crowd was too loud and the parade was getting too big. Who is that man? Someone asked. What is going on here? Asked another. The crowd answered, this is Jesus, God's king. He has come to save us. Some of the religious leaders murmured, Hush, Jesus, tell your friends to be quiet. It's way too loud here. But Jesus said, We can try to make these people quiet, but that wouldn't make a difference because today the whole earth is celebrating. Can't make the video. You're making silly faces. I'm not making silly faces. I'm making sad faces. Well, we can't make a video if you're making sad faces. Can you turn the frown upside down? There is a cup floating above your head. (laughs) How did that happen? That cheered me up. Oh, good. Here, you want to hear... The story for this? Oh. Yeah, you can pull that out. That's just an old bookmark. I get Hippo. Where did he 